we understood that basically consumers nowadays are, want to be more and more informed about what they buy and what they eat. The main concept of the Future Food District is to show how the technology may help the service of people. It will help us in order to develop a new uh, ideas to be applied in supermarkets. Uh, so the main goal of the project was to understand how to provide many information about the products in a very seamless and immediate way. in Italy is the main retail uh, actor. We work on a supermarket and hypermarket. We have about 8 million members because we are a co-op. So co-ops means cooperative and so our strength is in our members. Uh, what you see here actually it's not an artistic installation, it's a test bed on how new technologies will impact the retail um, sector. Um, so, we're robots, for example, we didn't want just to create a big experience within the supermarket, but we want to test exactly the reaction of the people um, interacting with robotics technologies. When Carlo Ratti comes to us talking about the interaction between people and technology, the natural answer for us uh, has been Yumi, the truly collaborative robot. We need a specific gripper for a managed apple that is not so easy to, to, to do. So what we have done is to develop a specific gripper using a 3D printer technology that uh, you can see on the installation. The reaction of people is curiosity and astonishment because of course we're not used to see robots in uh, the supermarket but I think that uh, the presence of Yume is uh, really answering the question in a very simple and relaxing way. How technology can improve the quality of life uh, of, our, of our citizens. The positive thing is that young people uh, immediately understand the, uh, the interaction with the shelves, with robots, with everything. Elderly people takes a while, but once you, you, you explain how the thing works, immediately they start playing with it. Automation technologies are more and more present uh, in, the, in, in retail in general, right? Robotics will actually allow us to, to bring um, automation technologies in a direct contact with the consumer. Our approach is very much experimental. We want to experiment, and this is a, 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 the, the perfect place to do a test pack. For us, it's, it's the kind of project we love. When we talk about ABB presence in Expo, of course, uh, the, the most evident uh, product is uh, the robotic cell we have just behind. But uh, we have, for example, other applications of ABB products in, uh, in Expo. I want to mention, for instance, uh, the low voltage division products, which are embedded in all the pavilions, but especially they are at the root of the tree of life, uh, which is a true symbol of the Expo 2015. This is a unique opportunity for people that is not involved in this type of uh, activity to see how ABB robots works. Interaction must be simple, must be immediate, must be intuitive. So I think also uh, people now is uh, really ready in order to have a bigger interaction with robots. Mm -hmm.